everyone, Beatles A32 back again with another deck review today. Uh, some very special decks that I received courtesy of Randy Butterfield and Midnight Cards. Uh, coming to the Kickstarter, they are the Pollock decks. So you got the Pollock Artistry deck and the Pollock Cardistry deck. They did not come in these cases. They didn't come with top cases. I put them in these cases. But anyways. Special thanks to Randy Butterfield for sending this my way. Coming to Kickstarter very soon. Uh, stay tuned for more information in the review. Alright, so these are the pull-up decks. Designed by Randy Butterfield. A.K.A. Midnight Cards. And being put out on Kickstarter by Mike Wilson. It's actually coming to Kickstarter uh, this Tuesday, September the 18th. So this came actually over like perfect timing to get me, allow me to get this out to you the day before, hopefully, the Kickstarter project launches. That's my plan anyways. So it should be, if this video is up Monday, tomorrow, <laughs> this comes out Tuesday. Unless I'm confused on my dates, but I'm pretty sure it's the 16th today. <laughs> um, anyway, very nice decks. These variations were printed by MPC. No tuck cases, which is unfortunate, but at least I had some uh, solutions to that. <laughs> Not the best solutions, but some solutions. Uh, these are the follow-up to the Oculus playing card, so let's get on with it. And the first one is the Artistry deck, which is very artistic with, well, paint splatter all over it. In a variety of colors, oranges and reds and blues and blacks. Pretty cool. Um, the Ace of Spades. There's no jokers with these decks. Uh, here is the jokers for these decks. I'll show you that right now. These are the jokers for the artistry deck. There's a jester and there's a forest. So when you're a jester and so when you're a card forest. Here are the Jokers for the Cardistry deck, also featuring the Jester and a Florist. More or less the same thing as the other deck, just different color scheme. Alright, so that was the Jokers. I had to show you pictures because at the time when he produced these through NPC, he did not have Jokers ready yet. Instead, we get a second Ace of Spades and a Double Backer. The Ace of Spades in this one, very... Uh, Orangey colors in the spade pit with the same colors as the back design in the background. You got kind of some spotlights. It's like it's a painting in a art gallery, which is pretty cool. It says Pollock uh, Artistry Edition, Artistry Deck, designed by Midnight Cards, produced by Mike Wilson, printed in Taiwan by Expert Point Cards. So they're going to be printed by Expert Point Cards on the project, which is great. You get a double backer, and of course, like I said, no jokers. But I do get a second ace of spades, so that could be used for tricks if I wanted. Court cards, uh, kind of your typical, what you would expect from Randy Butterfield for a deck like this. Just kind of a modified, recolored, borderless, nice big version of a standard court card. Uh, it's got the same color scheme as the back design within the court cards. And for the diamonds and the hearts, bluest colors, spades and clubs, yellowy colors. Uh, just a darker color scheme, sort of. And you do get a bit of a... That paint texture in the pips as well. The indexes. I'll just show you the court cards. You get red pips for the hearts and diamonds. Black for the spades and the clubs. Also, on number cards, you get this... Kind of a scratchy look in the faces, which is pretty cool. And, I mean, it's not bad. The back design, pretty nice. Should be pretty fun for cardistry and floors and stuff like that. And then we get the other one, which is the cardistry deck, which you could probably get by the back design. Again, it's very artistic looking. Very interesting. A nice yellow and blue colors. This one could probably be a lot better for fatting and floors. It actually hands quite good considering it's just a very limited prototype printed by MPC. The Ace of Spades, again, there's two in this deck. This one, it says the same thing except it says 
Pollock cardistry deck and you get the same spotlights like it's a painting hanging on the wall which is exactly what it looks like if this one is page in the clubs or in blue coloring hearts and diamonds or in yellow coloring you do get a double backer as well and the second ace of spades and then the court cards blue and yellow for the hearts uh, for the spades and the clubs and same for the yellow and the hearts and the diamonds i'm tongue-tied here same kind of textured look for the the cards for the artwork as you can see in the background there are the in the yellow and blue colors in the pips similar idea and nice number cards at the custom colored pips uh, overall pretty cool decks I would say again special thanks to Randy Butterfield for sending him my way I would probably say that these are you know like a solid 9 out of 10 even the handling is good on these decks for what they are <laughs> uh, so that is that I like it definitely worth checking out and go check it out on Kickstarter it should be live the day after this is posted I'll probably try to put a link in the description after it goes live if I don't forget so that is that again thanks to Randy Butterfield very nice decks I like it if you like his decks you're gonna like these ones without a doubt definitely worth checking out we'll see you next time for more thanks for watching